Now this looks like a very big money god and as a Chinese person I know that money is very important in the culture. That's right, <laughs> yes. So who better to show it off than the actual god? That's that right. Pray for? So the god of wealth here, um, a lot of the Asians pray it throughout the year, mainly during the Chinese New Year but throughout the year as well. It's because wealth is never enough. But the, the essence of wealth doesn't necessarily mean financial. It could mean um, economical, it could mean career progression, it could mean health and also family well-being. So the god of wealth doesn't only represents money. So when it talks about wealth, it talks about all of those elements there. Great, and I always have a question, Ying. Now, I know that I am yellow in complexion, but why is this god a bit darker than I am? A bit darker, yes. Yeah. Uh, because when we look back into history, this god is actually a star. So it's a, a star from the universe, and the, the actual color of the star was black. Oh, okay. So it transcended to um, the color of his skin. But as the years progressed by, as history evolved, he's changed to a, a lighter colour. A lighter colour, yes. Um, a little bit more closer to the complexion of Asians. Yeah. <laughs>